Hello my friends, in today's video, you can learn how you can create this amazing next level presentation in PowerPoint. First, go to insert, then shapes, and add a rectangular shape like I do. Right click on the shape, go to format shape and add gradient colors like I do. Go to insert, shapes and add rectangular shape like I do. Here I add a tab for each slide. Hold control and copy it six times. Hold control and select all the shapes. Then go to shape format, select shape outline and select no outline. Select the first shape. Go to Shape Format, then click on Shape Fill. Here, I select the eyedropper tool and choose a color from near the shape. I name this tab as Home. Do the same for other tabs. Here I add colors and names to the all the tabs. Right click, then go to Format Background and add your background picture. Add new slide. Insert background image. Duplicate the slide six time. Select all the six slides and add morph transition. Go to the first slide, select home tab, then click on insert and select link, now select slide one and click OK. Now select second tab, and link into the second slide. Do the same for other tabs. Now I highlight tabs related to each slide. Select Home tab, go to Shape Format, select Shape Fill as white and select Text Fill as black. Now copy and paste this tabs to other slides. Now go to the second slide and change second tab fill color to white and font color to black. Change Home tab fill color to black and font color to white. Do the same for other tabs. Now it's perfectly done. Here I add some text to the first slide, you can do it as your preference. Then go to the second slide, click on the insert, and I add this picture to the slide, you can add a picture as your preference to introduce your team. Then I crop each member's face to introduce them separately. Hold Ctrl, copy this face and crop the second face. Crop the next two face by using the same method. Add some text. Group the text and images like I do. Now copy all and paste it to the first slide. Move all to the downside.
It looks amazing. Now go to the third slide. Select insert and add rounded rectangular shape. Remove outline and change fill color to black. Now hold control and copy it two times. Add some text to the slide. Now copy and paste it to the previous slide. Move those to the right side of the slide. It looks amazing. Now let's move to fourth slide. Go to insert, select shapes, and add a circle shape. Go to shapes format, select no outline and select shape fill as black. Hold control and copy it four times. Now select all, group it and align it to middle and ungroup it. Go to insert and add some icons to the shapes. Add some text to the slide. Select first set of text and icons and group it. Do the same for other sets. Select title one group. Go to Animations and select Fly in Animation, then go to Effect Options and select from right. Do the same thing for other three groups. In the fourth slides, first go to Insert, then Charts, then select Donut Pie Chart. Then change the data of the pie chart like I do. Then select Chart, and then go to Format Chart Area, select Series Options and then change Donut Hole Size to 46%. Then click on the left side hole and select No Fill, and then choose the other fill colors like I do. Remove the border. Now move chart to the left side like I do. Go to insert and add circle and move it to the middle of the chart. Remove shape outline and change fill color to black. Go to Insert, Icons and add some icons to the slide. Place the icons like I do. Add some text to the slide. Copy all the text and paste those to the previous slide. Then move all to the right side of the slide. Select all the icons and then select chart and group it. Now copy and paste it to the previous slide. Move it to the right side like I do. Right click on it and send it to back. It's not look fine. Let's make some changes. Go to the sixth slide and right click on the chart and send it to back.
Now it's perfect. Let's move to 7th slide. First, go to insert and add this chevron shape. Now, draw it like I do. Hold control and copy it 4 times. Then select all and remove the shape outline. Change the shape fill color as your preference. Then go to insert and add a circle shape. Draw it like I do. Change its color to white. Now copy circle shape to other three shapes. Add some text. Now copy all the four shapes. Paste it to the previous slide. Move it to the left slide like I do. Now copy and paste all the text to the previous slide. Select all the shapes from previous slide and send it to back. Go to the next slide and do the same. It's perfect. Now let's move to the last slide. Here I add some graph and text. You can add as your preferences. Select both graphs and paste it to the previous slide. Now everything is finished. Let's see our final results. It's amazing. Thanks for watching. If you like the video, please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Goodbye until we meet again.